Hello everyone, I'm Steel. And I'm Teal. And we're with Studio Blue. Today we're doing a Let's Play of Nightingale Downs by Simpro Studios. Alright, we've had some good things from Simpros in the past, so let's see what the game is about. Let's go cool. ahead and start it up. Load them up. Ooh, Ooh. preloading. Love it. There we go. Oh, wow. That's a really pretty uh, map background thingy. Yeah, that is with the particle effects. And it is a beta demo. Okay, so we'll be playing a short demo. Wow. Let's take a look at the options here. I want to go walking in the woods. Right? Oh, man. Go walking in the mountains in the woods later on. Yeah. <laughs> Command, remember, full screen, sync. Okay, I think we're good. Okay. Oh, I like the music. With the strings and all that. Oh. Yeah. It really works for this This whole background thing. I like yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. Good job with, this tar with the startup music. Alright, here we go. Summer was but a fading memory. The sky receded into darkness each uh, We have the narration from Simpros coming. Speed, uh -huh. And your band turned its attention to gathering sustenance to survive the growing chill. Fellow creatures across the woods had heard and heeded nature's rhythms, and the deer were no different. These lush and verdant woods had served as your home for your entire life on Earth, and shielded your clan from the encroaching threat of man. What are we the playing, like fairies? Your group, Grammy, had foreseen Elves? a great upheaval many years ago, and now summoned you to his massive home, an ancient and towering oak tree. Meetings with the chieftain were quite rare indeed. Well, uh, we're, we're only staying quiet because we're listening to the narration. Otherwise, we'd be making commentary. Gramu was an imposing and impressive sight. With long antlers covered with the scratches and wear of many seasons past. Antlers. He spoke, detailing his concerns about recent signs of humans in the area. His voice deep and filled with concern, echoed through the tree hollow. Men had always been an unspoken dread, a shadow lurking over the downs. The chieftain spoke, telling you of the trust your tribe had in you, and that you were to investigate and report back if humans had indeed pierced the sanctity of the wood. You choke back a wave of fright, and agree to look around and find out what is happening. The chief beams with pride at your courage and bids you good fortune. Okay. We're playing a deer. Oh, that is so freaking cool. <laughs> that is really different. <laughs> yes, it is. Oh my god, this reminds me of uh, with the rabbits. Watership down. Yeah. Ah, now I know where you got Nightingale down. Watership down. There you go. One of my favorite <laughs> books and favorite movies. We have to name our, our deer character. Okay. That, that's what that is. Okay. Show. Um. <laughs> <laughs> what you thinking, Teal? <laughs> Bambi. Yeah, so that's what I was thinking, too. <laughs> There's literally no reason not to name the deer Bambi. I spell, I spell Bambi. B-A-M. B-I. B-I. <laughs> oh, right, there we go. Bambi. Oh. <sighs> How to play. Okay. Yeah, use keyboard and arrows. Simply left click on the map. Okay. Right click your mouse. Hit the escape key. All right. Q for tutorial. R for the save menu. M for the quest log. E to pull up your items. Okay. So okay. similar to other Simpros games. You marvel at the woods and what is a beautiful day and what a beautiful day it is. Since you seem to be lost as to what to do next, it makes perfect sense to visit Besame. The most wise and learned cow you know to get some idea on how to start your most important mission. You know she makes her home in the west where the grass is plentiful and the sun seems to shine the brightest. You only hope you don't disturb her lunchtime. Yeah, because cows get upset if you disturb the lunchtime. What an interesting uh, world map. It's like a pointillism painting. Yeah, I, I love it. And I yeah, love that's the, nice. having the leaves go by. The particle effects with the leaves just yeah. makes it that much nicer. This is great. Let's go ahead and save. 
The Adventures of Bambi. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right, we should go west. Yeah. Look at me walking. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> this is really cool. Oh, wow. Look. Ah, a, a the Karma Trader. Oh, that is awesome. All right, let's talk to Bessie. I think it's Bessie May. Bessie May? Yeah, let's talk yeah. to Bessie May. Look how cute they are. Yeah, they are adorable. The learned cow was well known in these parts. Oh, for his knowledge, for her knowledge. Yeah, because she's a she. Because a cow is, is, is a female. Right. Uh, the learned cow was well known in these parts for her knowledge of many distant lands. The bovine sage greets you with a small nod of its head. Most hearty greetings to you. Gramu has told me to expect your arrival. Yeah, so you, you put down his knowledge and then it, a small of its head. Just uh, if, Especially if you're trying to go for Watership Down, just use their gender. Never say its for uh, any of the animals. The beast gazes toward the horizon, and if a cow could sigh, it would. It is indeed the case that our majestic woods are threatened by humanity's eternal greed for power and territory. You have been charged with a most urgent mission. I can say the one most able to assist you in these woods is Julin, the lazy sheep. He traveled to the human lands briefly and can tell you what needs to be done to stop this terrible thing from happening. Just to the north of me, in the grove, lies Rennie. She will exchange your hard-earned karma for various benefits, so that you can grow stronger to face the danger ahead. Karma is a most rare resource in these times, so use it wisely. The cow slowly looks back at you. He is known to frequent the Violet Valley to the east of the treehouse. Find him there and speak with him, and you'll know what to do. The cow begins grazing once again. Good fortune to you, brave buck. So there's a couple of things you do need to watch with your sentences. Uh, you can't look away, you can't look back at somebody if you haven't looked away. Uh, that's just a for instance. Another one is you can't eat if you're grazing. So I do know some pros you love to use uh, very flowery language, per what's called purple prose, to kind of bring your stories to life. But uh, do watch that you don't say someone's doing something they can't physically do. Yeah. All right. And there goes the cow. Bye-bye, cow. We love you. But we found some karma. All right. So let's talk to Rennie. I'm thinking Kia. Oh, God, I'm thinking of the albatross. All right. <clears throat> Rennie is known for rewarding those who do the right thing and uphold goodness and faith. She stares at you, tilting her head. What can I do for ya? Scroll up and down to see all the choices. You have ten karma right now. Trade karma for training points. Hmm. Karma for a banana. Ooh, a banana. Banana. And then heal all your blood. Let's get Ooh. a banana. Oh, there's more. Okay, nothing. Thank you. Oh, okay. Page up, page down. Okay, cool. Right. Let's okay. go banana. Banana. Yay. And we have a banana. Cool. All right. Now we visit Julian in the Violet Valley, which is going to be this way. Yeah. Oh, we get in a fight. Ooh, random encounters. With, uh, what is that, a bear? I think it's a bear. It's a black bear. It's a black a bear. Oh. We're not going to win. <laughs> 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 if this was realistic, we'd be dead. Wow. <laughs> All right, here we go. Fighting the black bear with a hoof. There you go. And as usual in the Simpros game, we attack last. Uh-huh. All right, what is Rabid Bite? A powerful bite that can do more damage, but has more variance and costs spirit and blood to use. Oh, and then Blood Pummel. Furious hoof and biting attack that drains blood from your opponent and adds to yours cost spirit. Okay, okay, so that's our, uh, our, our special attack. That's attacks. HP and MP. Yeah, and, spirit. Okay. Right. And then we have our pouch, which has our items. Okay. Let's do another hoof punch. Gets the black bear. Yeah. That's missing. This is the lazy. This is the worst black bear ever. <laughs> hey, he just ate. He's not really interested. <laughs> I'm going to kill the stupid thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're just going to hoof it to death. <laughs> oh, my God. Hoof punch. Oh shit, oh I like the sound. 
That was cool. Yeah. Alright, let's let's do rabbit bite. <laughs> Woo! -hoo -hoo! Yeah. Awesome. Victory in Deerland. Uh-huh. So I wonder if there's any um treasure on the world map or is it just not uh, this thing. is a this is if this is anything like Simpros's other games, we're gonna have very defined treasure chests. Okay. Yeah, we're not gonna have hidden hidden treasure. And Simpros, if that means you've changed it, shame on you, man. You've set a precedent with your other games. <laughs> There's Julie and the lazy sheep. Ooh, and uh, the color scheme changed. It's a lot of blues. Yeah. In this part of the forest. Yeah, if this is also, this is supposed to be the Violet Valley, and you only have one Violet Tree, let's get a few more Violet Trees in there. Agreed. I see one purple tree way down there. Yep. And I, I see a couple of brown ones. I guess they're dead. And yeah. then a lot of green ones. There's, there's a blue one. There is a blue one. Let's go ahead and save again. So, save yeah, I want to see more purple trees. Yeah. Oh, by the way, I don't know if you noticed this. I just noticed this at the corner of my eye. But look at Bammy's attacks. Uh-huh. Uh Strike, resist, belief, defiance. So belief would be magic attack. Defiance would be oh. magic defense. Fortune is luck. That is that is so neat that he just just the little things like that. Renaming your stats. Yes. That is just so clever. And we have hooves. We have hooves. We have hooves. <laughs> All right. Let's talk to Julian the lazy sheep. One look at Julian and anyone can tell where his nickname came from. His gait is slow and laborious and even his very speech issues come out and even his very speech it issues out, out from a mouth that can barely, that barely wishes to move. A little clunky there. Hello there, what can I do for you today? You relate your story to the creature and his eyelids spring open more, if only very slightly. Yes, I did stumble upon a human settlement, but... He pauses, but not for dramatic effect at all. Okay. Uh, perhaps you could help us out with something. I don't know. Uh, eyelids spring open more, if only very slightly. Uh, try to avoid using the word very, for one. And Simpros, I'm going to definitely be hard on you with your, uh, with your pros, because you're so good at it. We can make it even better. Uh, don't use the word very... And if someone's eyelids spring open, they do not open slightly. Yeah, they open wide. Yeah. <laughs> the valley well that all the forest relies on for clean water has been ravaged recently by some nasty, dirty pigs. Yeah. His disdain is obvious even more, though the... Oh my god. Langor... Langor... Lang Langvoriously told... T I have not read that word in a long, long time. Please head west and slaughter the nasty swine. So do we head north and west or west? West. Well, there's a well somewhere. Yeah. What if it's north? A attack a is north. Encounter. Against a tree! Wow, that's an angry tree. <laughs> it's the a possessed, possessed tree. <laughs> We're going to hoof it to death again. Yes, we are, because that's what we do. We are a violent, <laughs> crazy deer. Oh, my God. Uh, pouch. Banana. Banana. Oh, my Ouch. God. This thing's kicking our ass. Ah. Blood puddle. That just about took our everything we gained for the banana. Yeah, that did. Aye, aye, aye. Balancing issues. All right, we're going back home. Yeah. Forget this noise. I we're go we're not going north. Nope. North bad. Yeah, north is real bad. There's the North Valley well. Oh, okay. Let's heal. Yeah, heal. Can we go to sleep? Can we heal? go inside there? Oh. Oh. Okay. We're well, in trouble. where's the uh, inn, the safe point? Yeah, where's our um, car? We have karma. Let's go fully heal. Uh, We got to heal at the bird. Okay, so the bird is our inn. Yeah. The bird is the inn and also our banana <laughs> shop. Oh, crap. Another tree. What? Can we run? Can we escape? Yes, escape. Oh what? shit! What? How can you? How can we fail? No, 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 no fail. No fail. Ah! No fail. 
Uh, these possessed trees are horrible. They're terrifying. <coughs> oh my god, we are getting our butts kicked by a tree. God, it's like a whomping willow. <laughs> Ow. Oh, the hit rate. You gotta watch the hit rate, man. Everyone's missing. Oh, wow. Miss, 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 miss. That loses its miss. fun real fast. Miss, miss, miss. Why are we all missing? Oh, we got some dewberry leaves. leaves. What does that do? Uh, dewberry leaves restores blood spirit and gives us experience point. Okay, well, we'll, we'll uh, use that after we... Let's heal. Let's just heal with the... Yeah. With the bird. All right, so 15 karma, heal 100% blood, 100% spirit. Oh, this is so ridiculous. Uh, that is completely unnecessary. Just give us 15 karma for a full heal. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. 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 Because now you're making us try to gain 30 karma. Right, and karma is very hard to come by. We currently have 27, so I can't full heal. All right, and we're not healing spirits, so forget our powers. All right, let's go fight some pigs. Let me save first. Yeah, save. We could just, you know, like I said, hoof them. Yeah, let's hoof them to death. Hoof the pigs. Ah, uh, North Valley well. The well of the North Valley is known for its crisp, clean water, but as you approach it now, a slightly foul odor hits your sensitive nostrils. You hear a squeal, and a large, ugly pig charges at you, its eyes gleaming with malicious intent. Oh, man. Look I at that pig! I, I, I want bacon. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's fry some bacon. You just make some bacon. Are you aching for some bacon? Bambi becomes carnivorous. Yes! And we're missing! The music, though! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. this is so cute! And it's a dirty pig! Oh, man, we continue to miss as they dance around each other, growling. Oh, oh God, someone got a hit in. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Oh, we're so going to die. We're going to get killed by a pig. No, we didn't. We killed the pig. Oh. Uh, we hoofed the pig to death. It's bacon time. Oh, that was funny. Okay. You stop and rest a bit after your fight. Not being a particularly aggressive type. <laughs> what? I, don't, I beg to differ. We, we've been, we've hoofed a bear and yeah. two trees Dude. and a pig. I, I think I'm pretty aggressive. I think I'm a very violent deer. Besides, have you ever seen deer out in the wilderness? Especially bucks? Oh, oh. They're assholes. Okay. <laughs> All right, just All when right. you start to approach the wall, another pig emerges from the bush, accosting you once again. Shit! Oh, this sucks. Okay, uh... Dirty pig attack. Just just bite it. Bite the pig to death. There you go. <laughs> Another thing, by the way. Oh. Uh, a deer's bite ain't all that. <laughs> Turn the bite into something like antlers. Because those antlers will kick your ass. Well, you don't know. Maybe antlers is a, a, a training thing that unlocks. True. Very uh -huh. possible. Very possible. However... A deer's bite isn't going to cause that much damage. Uh, just point that out. Okay, two training points regained. Yay! You can use these to raise character stats with the training feature in the main menu. Yeah. And we did not fully heal because our spirit still sucks. Yep. The fight ended. You swivel your head around, peering at your surroundings. It appears you have repelled the nasty swine, and you can return to Julian and report the good news that the Valley Well has been restored to health. Cool. Uh, oh, we fully healed. Okay, we did fully heal at the... Now that we've gained... Yay, we gained a level and we fully healed. That's amazing. Let's train. <laughs> you sound so uh, enthusiastic. <laughs> I can't believe I bit a pig to death. Uh, <laughs> shall we raise resistance and maximum blood or maximum spirit or what? What shall we raise to you? Uh, well... Let's uh let's raise our um maybe agility. Hmm. I don't know. Pick one. Let's we'll definitely raise our our damage. Yeah, resist. let's do yeah. that. Resist. And maybe the agility go a little faster. Let's go faster. 
Maybe we won't miss so, so much either. <laughs> All right, we save again. Yay! Oop, that's no. No, that's button. not saving. That's not saved. That's called back. Yeah, it's called still doesn't know what he's doing. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. La 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 la. I'm a deer. I'm a deer. I'm a deer. I'm the cutest deer in the forest, and we get attacked by a sheep. A sheep. Wait. We're gonna go. An oh, evil that's sheep. An evil sheep. <laughs> Alright, we, we, we're going to stomp you and bite you to pieces! Urgh! The curve stomper! <laughs> curve stomp that sheep. Oh, the life of the, in the forest is so violent. What are you in for? We're in here for ripping a man to pieces! <laughs> <laughs> that was uh, the old Serta commercials, right? Yes. Oh, that's yep. funny. <sighs> All right, let us continue. Let's our continue. Okay. But this, J Julian's a good sheep. Yeah, he he's he's a he's a good sheep, a lazy sheep, but a good sheep. Mm -hmm. The lazy sheep appears almost pleased, almost. Well, what an ungrateful bastard! <laughs> wow, sheep are shitty. <laughs> I have heard that you faced those dirty swine and took care of them. A most pleasant development. His face turns towards the sky. Do you see that sun, my friend? There is no sunlight without freedom. Huh? I don't get it. <laughs> Are they trying to be metaphoric here? But I'm not getting it. <laughs> Great Frith, please help us. <laughs> and the human species jeopardizes that freedom. Our freedom that we have struggled long to obtain. Far to the north lies the human settlement. A place called New Hope. Trust me, furred one. The name belies its dark intentions. His eyes glimmer with fear and a spark of hope. You can't have two emotions showing at the same time. They can shift between one and the other. To the uh, east lies the copper clearing, which has not been well explored, but there are rumors of something that may help you there. Is it a gun? It better be a gun. <laughs> I would explore it myself, but I am far too content here, as you could see. Right, because oh. he's lazy. <laughs> lazy asshole is what he is. <laughs> Our hope lies with you, courageous one. May good fortune follow you always. The sheep returns to its grazing, and you are left to wonder and think about this creature's words. Onward, you guess. Uh, I think Bambi's just confused as, uh, as we are. Yeah. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and... What are you doing? Saving. Oh. Because I might get eaten by a tree. <sighs> right. And now we're going to go east. Yep, east. Past the, 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 the dead... Those are dead brown trees, man. Those are. Those are dead trees. Yeah. I want, I want more purple. Wow! What the hell? We are now that in... Is, uh, wow. Bright uh, and garish and pink. Very pink. I like pink. And the pink bridge. is good. And Frelly the Fox. That's a boy fox. That is. I'll oh. read it. You've always known Frelly to be an endless source of trouble, so his sneaky manner does not surprise you. Hey you there, Bambi. Nice to see you. Hey, hey, almost in the same breath. I seem to have lost my magic lamp. That's cute. I know it's around here somewhere. I love that thing. It's so pretty, all shiny and gold, and you know. He continues onward, barely pausing again. Well, anyway, I've heard of your little quest, finding those nasty humans. So if he's barely pausing, you probably don't need to narrate that. Probably. I found this key a little while back, and it looks like something men would use to lock up something. Find my magic lamp, and I'll give you the key. Fair enough? Good. You wish this creature would slow down just a bit. It looks like you have a lamp to find. Ooh, old fire pit. There's old fire pit. You see a plume of smoke, and as you enter a clearing, you come upon a small hole in the ground that seems to have glowing bits of wood in it. You know the animals do not use fire in this manner. They don't use fire at all. So it can only mean one thing. Humans were here recently. Uh-oh. Your heart sinks as you realize that maybe, just maybe, you're too late. Your legs propel you forward even faster, knowing your mission cannot be delayed a second longer. You even stumble on an item on the ground that you take and keep. It's, Ooh, a, juicy it's a juicy pear. pear. Cool. I want a juicy pear. I do too. Mm. I want some venison. 
Nope, you get pork instead. Woohoo! Pork chops! <laughs> Alright, let's hoof punch the pork. <laughs> Dirty pig! <laughs> of course. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> We're gonna miss a lot! <laughs> that is stupid pig. Actually, there we go, we kicked smart. it to death. Yes, we did. We cooked, we kicked the pig to death. I don't know, pig versus deer, I don't unless it's a wild boar. Uh-huh. I don't think that pig's gonna win. I don't think so either. If it's a wild boar, it's a dead uh it's a dead buck. Alright, let's use where's items? Couch. So it looks like this uh this map is a is a dead end on the yeah. east. So actually that's pretty cool. You 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 stay on the you don't have too many branchings off here, there, everywhere. It's, yeah. um, you're pretty focused. Which is good, especially for, for an adventure like this. Yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and use Tasty Grapes. Mmm, so Tasty raise, Grapes. Raise our, uh, yeah. max spirit. Cool. And then let's use the Dewberry Leaves. It will, even though we'll lose some spirit heal, we'll get a bunch of blood and get an experience point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yay. Oh, we're going to save again. Because we never know when the evil trees are going to attack. Oh, I know. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Do, 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 do. Violet Valley. Let's go north and see what yeah. happens. Fire yeah. remnants and Tessa and the turtle. Oh, there's a turtle. You know, I'm partial to turtles. I know. Turtles are pretty cool, too. I, I, I like turtles. As you approach the remains of this fire, out of the bushes leaps a pair of assailants intent on you becoming their next meal. <gasps> dun, no. dun, dun. Oh, we get attacked by pork and lamb chops <laughs> that are going to try to eat us. They want venison, I guess. <laughs> All of a sudden, they've become carnivorous. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, this entire forest has now become carnivorous. <laughs> Evil humans. <laughs> They've done this. <laughs> I think you need to change this from instead of making us our next meal, uh, I don't know, defending their territory or something. Because uh, I ain't buying that a pig and a sheep are carnivorous. I'm not buying it either. All right. Let's kill some something. Let's, uh... <laughs> shall we do a rabid bite or shall <laughs> we do a blood pummel? Blood pummel! <laughs> blood pummel! On the evil sheep! On the evil, on sheep. The evil sheep! All right, on the evil sheep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boom! <laughs> yeah, get that sheep. Hoof murder the sheep. Oh, we missed the sheep. Damn it! We're gonna shave you. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! It's I'm a dead sheep. Much fun out of this. This is great. All okay, right. dirty pig. <laughs> You're ours. Oh, such violence! <laughs> Yay! Yay! A piranha, piranha root. root. Cool. I don't know what it does, but it's awesome. The foul beasts fall to the ground, deceased. Use your antlers to poke around the fire, and out pops a shiny and golden lamp of some sort. Fire. Furley will be delighted, and you're hoping the key you get will have some use. I'm sure it will. How do we heal? Uh, what does piranha root do? Uh, piranha root. Oh, okay. What? Increase strike. Increase the strike. Okay, it's a combat item. And, of course, magic lamp. Right. And then that, which we'll hold on to that a little while uh, We're going to hold on to the juicy bear. Want to talk to Turtle? Yes, I want to talk to the turtle. Tessin was known to be quite the worrying type. He appeared even more so than usual this day. Oh, dear, oh, dear. I am most hungry this afternoon and cannot seem to find any worms to snack on. Perhaps... And with this came pleading eyes. Perhaps you could find me some tasty worms. I believe three of them should be sufficient. In return, I could show you how to get through those nasty rapids to the north. What say you? Time to put on your worm finding hat. Okay. Time to dig up worms. Yeah, we can dig some worms. All right, first let's return. Yeah. Oh. Worm mound. <laughs> that is the kind of the cutest worm I've seen in a while. Yes. That's a very cute worm. That is. 
Use your hooves, dig into the dirt, and find a big tasty worm there. Tessin will be most pleased. All right, let's go back also. We need to uh, buy some more bananas. Yeah, we need bananas. Although I will say, bananas in a uh, in a forest like this, I, I don't know. They don't grow Yeah. In, in this type of forest. They are tropical fruits. Yeah. So maybe change ooh, the banana. Ooh, more tree. worms. Yeah. Okay, wormy. <laughs> Yay, big happy worm. Yay. All right, how much karma do we have? 47 karma. Okay, we are going to buy a banana. Uh-huh. Okay. We got to go back. Okay. Shall we heal him, heal with him or just buy bananas? What do you think? Let's just buy bananas. Buying banana. Banana. All right. I think one more banana should suffice. Yeah. There right, here we go. Banana. Okay. Okay. And we get into a fight of with course. a dirty pig. He wants to avenge his cousins. Yes. <laughs> we kill the pig. Oh shit! We missed. And it misses. As we dance around each other, making noises. Bye, Wilbur. <laughs> I guess he's not some pig. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, that, that orange fun. tree's nice. Yeah, it is. I, actually, this is my favorite area right here, as far as aesthetics go, so far. But I still don't know. Okay, I don't know why there's a um, snow-covered tree beside the orange tree. Where's that? Oh, that's a bluish. That is a very light blue. That does look like snow, doesn't it? It looks like snow. Yeah. It looks like a snow-covered tree. Might want to check that coloration there. All right. Go between the two dead trees. Yep. Towards the foxy fox. With this. Oh, my God. It blows my eyeballs out. Yeah, this is way too saturated. Woo! And we got the last orb. Yay! Cool. Yeah, the turtle's hungry. Freli is an excitable type. Of that, there is no doubt. He bounds up to you, his voice squealing with delight. The lamp! My magical lamp! Thank you, my friend! Here's the key! And with that exclamation, he disappears into a hole in the ground that used to be inhabited by worms. <laughs> Bammy is now level three! Yay! And we found a juicy pear. All right, let us train. Yeah. I think we've got a good thing going on, raising resistant agility. What do you I think? think so. Let's do that some more. Okay. Boom. And boom. Yeah. Oh, okay. Boom. Boom. Uh-huh. And then save. And then we go back to our turtle friend. Yay, because we love turtles in this house. Uh-huh. Absolutely. Oh, what are we... This? Oh, what is this? A hungry raven... Okay. This is not even a fair fight. <laughs> this uh, is... Ah! Ah! A raven <laughs> is going for a deer. It's going to be a very, very hungry raven. You're going to peck our eyes out. <laughs> yeah, I bet it dodged. It's a freaking raven. There's going to be a lot of dodging. Yes. Yes, there is. Miss, There's going to be miss, a lot of not miss, hitting. Miss, 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 miss. Don't miss. hit. Miss, miss. <laughs> <laughs> God, look at it. Miss, miss, miss. Oh, they got to bite it. Catch it, catch it in my teeth. <laughs> Yay, I ate the raven. That's just so <laughs> Wow. Mm, tastes like chicken. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're a deer that eats meat. We are. We are a meat-eating deer. Okay, let's go ahead and use the juicy pear. Mmm, juicy pear. I, I'm going to have to get a pear after this. Uh, yeah. What did I do? I did not do anything. Wait. What? Restores 15 blood and 12 spirit. I'm not reading that wrong. It did nothing. Oh, it did do something. Okay. For some reason, it didn't update properly. You might want to check yeah, that. Yeah, it did, it did Um, kind of... Kind of farted Some, on yeah, us. Something, yeah, the screen was screwed up. Yeah. It didn't update. Whew. All right, scared me for a second there. I thought we wasted a pair. I'd get mad. Yeah. Oh, I'd get real mad if we wasted a pair. 
And we also, go. take a look at that with the antlers. See how that's coming behind there? I think we should go in front of the tree, not behind the tree. Yeah, yeah. we yeah. need to be in front of the tree. Do, 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 to the turtle. Yay for turtles. Uh-huh. Oh! Wow! Right yeah. there in front of the turtle. Wait, what is that? Is that a dog? That's a lost puppy. You're going to have us kill a lost puppy? Kick it! Kick it in the face! <laughs> oh, yeah! All right, puppers, time to die. Oh, God. You're obviously from the human camp. Right. Bye-bye, Fido. <laughs> That's wrong. And we take his bone. <laughs> cool. All right. Oh, shit. Okay, Tessa, take your dog on worms. Tessin's manner doesn't seem to change much. He accepts the worms and downs them in one gulp. Only a small burp indicates anything happened. Here's the way across, young buck. Thank you for a most delicious meal. He crawls off to seek the solace of water, you assume. That is one depressed turtle. Yeah, he is. Wow. You know, they have medicine for that. They do. <laughs> All right, so now we know we can go north because the rapids, but let's not do that yet. Uh, oh, okay, all okay, right. okay, okay, okay. Well, we have more locations, more story, more stuff to find. Should be released in October. Awesome. Okay, that's awesome. Yeah, I look forward to that. Yeah. Well, I'm going to be honest, uh, Teal. I don't have a whole lot of criticisms here. They're just the nitpicky stuff we mentioned uh, about the writing and, and other things in the... Uh, well, y yeah, you're, you're focused on the writing, but I'm focused more on the art. And mm -hmm. I, I believe that uh, you can do a, a little bit more to tweak these maps to where, one, uh, they're not as uh, uh, eyeball glaring. Uh, the, the fox glade really just made my eyeballs hurt. Uh, but two, since you name each glade after a particular color or something, then you need to have that color be predominant on the trees. Uh, the Violet Veil, you could have several different shades of purple trees and, uh, you know, etc., etc., etc. Get rid of your dead brown trees, uh, unless you're trying to make some sort of statement with that. And, uh, yeah, and... Other than that, I, I'm, I'm, I think it's it's great. I love the animals. Yes. It, er, all the animals are, are really cute, even the dirty pigs. <laughs> I will say, I don't know about the lost puppy. That was just kind of weird. I can't imagine a puppy. I mean, I, I know we're having some suspension of disbelief, but a little puppy? In the middle of the woods? I, well, you know, I, it could have been because of the, the humans were camping there. Right. And they had their fires, so... it probably was a puppy with the with the humans yeah well um so yeah but uh good job really fun v actually despite the whole the missing thing has to be fixed the constantly missing each other's attacks that's that, gotta get fixed that's yeah got, yeah that's got and, and and on your your healing uh bird there uh 15 karma for one thing and 15 karma for another nah you need to combine them. Just say 15 karma for a full heal. Yes. And uh, I would I would highly suggest maybe once being able to go into Grandma's Den and healing yourself or resting. Uh, well, that'd be, be nice. Because we're opening the game, so maybe there's a one time he lets us do it just once and notify the player that they can do it just once. Do you want to use it now or not? Uh, just so that when we're first starting out and things aren't, really balanced. I mean, things are not balanced until you use that first couple of training points. That's true, yeah. yeah. We have a chance to do a free full heal. Just a thought. All right. <laughs> cool. Go ahead. All right, well, if you like what you saw, like the smack down on the like button below. Subscribe to our channel. Consider supporting us on Patreon. Connect with us over Discord, Facebook, Twitter, and we will see you in the next video. See you next time.